so the, for the seventh and final basic tutorial for Tinkercad, we have to align these blocks. And you can see on the left here, it has an image of how this align works. Okay, so we're going to click over to the next one, and it tells us to explore the different ways that these box shapes can be aligned. So if we click outside all three boxes and highlight all three at the same time, and then use this button up here on the right, which is the align button, or we use the quick key L, you can see that it places these black circles around the three shapes. I'm going to click my arrow up so you can see this top box a little bit better and zoom out just a smidge. You can see that the shadows underneath show you that these three boxes are not aligned all in a row. They are all in different places. And if we scroll this way, you can see that they're at different heights as well. So on the left, it tells us step by step what we want to be able to do. And we want to see all the different positions that we could possibly align it to. So by just moving my mouse over top of the buttons without actually clicking anything, it shows you where the boxes will align to if I do click on that shape or on that dot. Now, if I scroll down, it tells me that I need to hover and look at the different ones and I already have. So if I continue, it looks like I want all of my boxes to align to this front line here. So to do that, um, I'm going to hover over the bottom left circle and you can see that my shadows all line up in this front row here. So if I click on that button, it brings them all to the front. And then it wants us to continue. So we move over to the next page here and it has us lining them up all on the bottom. And as you see, if I rotate here, they're all lined up in the front and the shadows are next to each other, but they're not all on the bottom. So to get them all on the bottom, if I hover over my little black dots here, I can see that this one on the very bottom here is gonna bring them all down onto my work plane. And now I am done.